Once your work is complete, you can store it into a personalized library in the Library Explorer. Click on the icon to create a personalized library and to give it a name. Using the plus or minus sign, add or remove categories or subcategories. To change a name, right-click on the category and select Rename. Once your categories are done, Drag and drop diagram components into the personalized library. All the properties of the component will be saved. You can also store groups of components. Select components and click on the group icon in the toolbar. Or you can select components and by right-clicking select group option. You can also put texts and images in the library. Save your library in a directory of your choice. By default, it will be in an Automation Studio directory called Libraries. You can close your personalized library using the following icon. Once you reopen your personalized library, all your saved icons, groups, texts, and images will be present. If you close Automation Studio with an opened personalized library, the library will be present when restarting Automation Studio. Enter a password to save and block access to the library.